Hello once again and thank you for joining me on sidamastrology.com. This is your Vedic Astrology Alignment with the Tarot Reading for a brighter day to guide you over the sea of life. Here today we are dealing with the Water Trine for a general Tarot Reading for all Ascendants covering the period March 20th to April 2nd 2022. This is Tarot Week 12 and 13 for the water trine. Welcome once again to ZDAMastrology.com. The water signs as we know it are Cancer, Scorpio and Pisces in our zodiac. And I have gone through the analysis of the trines in my previous videos for week 9, 10 and 11. However, should you have further queries or questions on this, I am always available at zdamastrology.com. Drop me a line, an email, a WhatsApp message, or you can ask a question and I will share with you information as best as I can. Again, the transit of the Graha and the explanation of this slide. I have begun that detailed analysis in Tarot Week 9. You can also get it in Tarot Week 10 and 11. But it explains the trines in the Fire Trine, Earth Trine, Air Trine and Water Trine. The trines synergy in Vedic Astrology and Tarot is given here showing you the alignment of the houses 159 that makes up the trine any way you count it or check it or review it and it also introduces the Kendras, the houses of Lord Vishnu and these are the houses 1, 4, 7 and 10 in Vedic Astrology. Again, you can get further details on this or an explanation in my previous video. Okay, we are going to deal with the selection of the tarot cards for the fire, earth, air and water trines. And this is the Lenormand pack that I'm going to deal with. And as I did in the last weeks, I am going to deal the entire 36 cards for the Lenormand pack so that all the cards are utilized and that you know there is no repetition of a reading it's a better uh, visual it's a better focus for me and for you as a client or subscriber to understand the potential obstacles and successes for each trine and all that I'm doing is dealing the pack out into four stacks um, each would have nine cards each and it will be fire, earth, air, and water. Those are the, the stacks. And you know, it's not only for your benefit, it's for the benefit of anybody whom you may know that are in the other trines, whether it's friends or family. You know, you will know what are the potentials for this period and how to deal with certain situations with them if you are interested in looking at the other videos that I'll be putting out from this um this video here so that i'm doing four videos you know one on fire which is the stack that i'm dealing with there now one on earth then one on air and one on water so that you know you may know people who are in these trines and we will learn from this for them so i'm going to do it in a backward um way now in that we are going to deal with water first and we are going to look at the first card for water which is snake and that first card is snake the second card is dog the next card is coffin coffin the fourth card is lilies lilies the next card is house house then we have tower tower birds is what we pull for water trying here then gentleman and the final card for the water trine is key key so that is the nine card spread for the water trine we are going to deal with the air trine now and you know what let me just see if I can give you a visual of these cards so that you can see the entire nine card spread here you know 
I'm just pulling them just just for a visual so that you can see you know the cards on how they are going to be dealt with even though I'm giving you the selection individually <clears throat> it's just for a, a visual okay and the first card here for a is mice mice the next card is child then we have tree tree as tree in the forest then we have stalk letter is the next one upcoming letter then we have what do we have here stars stars then we go to whip whip the penultimate card is crossroads and the final card is rider rider so then we go to the earth trine cards now and let us do the nine card spread for this and the first card here is ring ring the next card is garden followed by the sun followed by the sun and then we have the clouds mm. <laughs> rain and sunshine here and then we have lady lady followed by cross a cross then we have mountain mountain followed by clover clover and then the final card here for the earth shrine is fish fish so all we have now to do the nine card spread for is fire so let's get that done and move on the first card in fire trine is number 10 the site 10 the site you know the farmer's site that you do harvesting in and then you have number 32 the moon the moon then you have the ship ship and followed by bookie number nine the bookie and then the next card we have here is book book then it's followed by the fox fox heart number 24 heart and anchor is the card which is just before the final card of the beer so that is the cards we have here and that's what we are going to look at for fire earth air and water okay water trine let's start off with your reading for the nine card spread for the lenormand pack for tarot week 12 and 13 and your core card that you have for this period is the snake and the snake is all about deception it's all about seduction sensuality sex enemy betrayal greed so that you have to be very careful for this period whether it's you operating like that or someone operating like that around you and here we have the dog and normally a dog is a, a faithful friend but in this respect you know when you look at all the deception it's coming from somebody who you believe is your friend who you feel has been faithful to you so that that uh, manipulative person might be around you know they may be desiring a relationship with you so you just have to be careful about friends around you just take a second look you know don't be over sensitive about it but understand that you have to be very careful for this period and then we see the coffin here too and again the coffin is usually usually ending of something but this in this respect here means that you are giving up a desire you know you might have a desire to do something but you are giving up on that desire so what desire is it is it to seduce something or someone is it to deceive something or someone you know what it is you are giving up on with this coffin with this ending and lilies are usually about sensuality and sex so that the snake there is all about you know a craving and addiction it will enhance 
your sen sexuality, your seductive desires, your greed maybe. So that lilies there is an enabler for you this week. Just be careful. And then we have the house. And house is usually about family tradition. But the house in this respect is that somebody probably close to you. That close relationship. You may share family with this person. Or they may be a member of the family. You know, just look twice. Don't go accusing everybody or anybody. You know, this can just be something that you may be seeing. Or you may have been deceived about. Or you have been manipulated. So that, you know, you need to just take a second look don't go flying off the rail just be careful and then we have the tower and the tower is about isolation it's about arrogance it's about uh authority you know it's about governance so when we take the tower with uh lily what do we see we see that there you whether you or someone else has the authority in a sexual relationship is it that that is the kind of relationship you are looking at or that you desire that somebody to dominate you or isolate you from your family and put an, are you going to put an ending to that what is this desire that is overwhelming for you this period and then we have the birds and the birds are all about worry and gossip and when you pair the lily with the birds you have gossip you have talk so that on your mind or around you that's the talk on sex on ethics on morals on on your sensuality and probably relationships with a sexual partner so that that may be what the gossip is about with birds and it's all dealing with men and the man here the gentleman is a male in your life who will be faithful and Probably you need to look at the woman in your life who may have begun some kind of gossip or even if the male is there, you know, because if we look at birds, snake and gentleman, there might be some gossip that is deceiving you about a gentleman in your life. And the final card that we have here is key and key is about openness, revelation, you know, unlocking something. But when you look at the dog and the key, you find that you have probably a desire to make a new friend um, you want to unlock certain things that you weren't doing and there might be male persons involved in this so that for you water trying it's all about sensuality and sexuality but it's also bringing to you betrayal and deception so be careful don't isolate yourself too much don't gossip too much be careful of close persons who may look faithful, but they are very manipulative. Take a second look at those close to you, probably in your home or a house close to you, so that you cannot be deceived or manipulated for this period, beginning March 20th, 2022. Thank you for listening to this video. I ask that you share, you subscribe and you sign up. Bhagwan's blessings has once again brought me to the end and I hope that the messages resonate with you. Please visit my channel at zedamastrology.com to get further details about how these videos and analyses can be specific to you. I thank you once again and hope that you remain happy, healthy and safe until the next time. Bye.